In the past few videos, we've learned how to read a type of music called tablature. Tablature is a form of music where the strings are represented by lines and the frets of the instrument are represented by numbers. I walked out of my house today here in Savannah, Georgia and noticed it was really cold. So I decided today and tomorrow's song will be a song about cold. We're going to learn to play Jingle Bells in first position. So let's review first position. That means my first finger is in the first fret and my other three fingers line up in second fret, third fret, and fourth fret. All notes that occur in the first fret will always be played by the first finger. All notes played in the second fret will always be played by the second finger. Notes in the third fret will always be played by the third finger. Notes in the fourth fret will always be played by the fourth finger. Jingle Bell will be divided into two separate sections. The first section we're going to learn today is the part most everybody recognizes as the main theme. So let's get started. The first note we're going to play is the second fret G string. We're going to play this note seven times. This is what it sounds like. Then I'm going to play that idea again. So the first six times I play it sounds like this. The next motif starts with that same note. The next note we play after that is the first fret B string. So the two notes sound like this. Second fret G string, first fret B string. So if I play that in context with the entire phrase, it sounds like this. See how that works? The next note is the third fret D string. So let's think about how this is going to work. We are going from the first fret B string. We are skipping over the G string and coming to the third fret D string. You may need to practice that jump a couple of times. First fret B string, skip the G string, D string. Once you feel comfortable with that, we'll move on to the next two notes. The next note is the open G string. That's pretty easy. You don't have to do much. And it ends where we started on the second fret G string. So that second motif is like this. You will need to practice that a few times in a row before moving forward. Once again. Here's the entire first phrase. <laughs> 